Hey, it's Dave. And Jace. And we're the two middle-aged X-Gens, and we're coming to you live, kind of, on a Tuesday night from the Dinky. Are we really live? Yeah. Well, we're not live. I'm not going to do live. I hate live. You, man, you screw up big time when you go live. Yeah, well. Yeah. So We can delete this if we have to, right? Oh, yeah. I'm just kind of seeing how many minutes I got left. <clears throat> Tell you what. This is some serious stuff, man. Yeah, everybody hunkering down. Social distancing. Kinda. I mean, we are in a way. But Jason and I are like uh, attached to the hip, so yeah. we're kind of screwed. If he gets it, I get. I get it. Vice mm -hmm. versa. So I don't know, man. My kids aren't doing it very well. That's for sure. My kids aren't either. Are your kids seriously? Are your kids yeah. social distancing? <laughs> really? Uh, Mine aren't. Mine aren't either. I mean, everybody goes home, but <sighs> I don't know, man. This is some serious stuff. Did they pass the stimulus tonight or not? Do you know? I have no idea. Man, I got friends that we'll probably find out. are. Uh, lost their jobs I mean they're just not, not working and it's not good it's not good at all I mean all these <clears throat> friends of mine that are going on unemployment because the profession that they're in they're not working anymore I mean you got the restaurant industry the bar industry um, Luckily, I work in parts, you know, I'm, I sell parts for a living all over the world and luckily the world market on parts, the kind of parts that I sell is pretty good. Um, I mean, Jason, he, you know, he works in accounting at a hospital and they need him. Yeah, so, lucky I'm not non-essential at the hospital, but... Well... I mean, I am non-essential at the hospital. We still got to be there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, some they people haven't have sent us home yet, so that's good. But thing. you know what? We might as well put a shout out to everybody that's given their efforts. And I'm telling you, I've got personal friends that are EMTs that are wearing masks right now, and all the PPE equipment all over this country. I mean, um, some of these people that I know have been like. Uh, by the ships, you know, the ships that came in in Oakland, that <clears throat> ship with 3,000 people that got, had to get quarantined. I mean, it's just not good. Not good. I don't know if y'all can see it, but there is a plexiglass. Yeah, there, there is. Right here. There's a plexiglass so, thing right here. We are social distancing. Yeah, so. Um, <clears throat> but on a serious note, I mean, everybody needs to be hanging out by themselves for right now. But you know what? Here we go. I'm just going to just tell it like it is. We're going to get through this. Everybody, we're going to get through this. Y'all just hunker down. The president came out today and he said he mentioned it yesterday, but he's talking about Easter. Easter is April 12th, which is 19 days from now. I did that math real quick, didn't I? Okay. 19 days. So, um, something tells me that at some point uh, he's going to say, or there's going to be certain areas of the country that are going to be on total quarantine. In some areas in the state. I mean, if you look at Alabama, Birmingham is not looking good. Mm -mm. All of those folks up there are getting tested and it's getting weird uh, a lot of positive tests um, we've got some friends that uh, we went to school with whose parents or our father is uh, at Thomas Hospital right now on a ventilator with uh, COVID-19 doing his best trying to make it out and uh, my father I mean luckily <clears throat> he's he's not suffering from COVID 19, but um, he's got a, uh, a blood problem. But he's at Thomas Hospital right now, and he wants to get out. I mean, 
it's a bad thing right now and we all need to just hunker down it's it's almost kind of like a hurricane you know um, but long, we don't know long, about this one long hurricane a long one but we don't know where it's gonna hit you know yeah. I mean Mobile and Baldwin County I think have what four four five there's three positives. here for sure yeah so nobody yeah. really knows so anyways you know <clears throat> we just want to say um, we're thinking about everyone and, and hey, go order takeout from yeah. one of your local restaurants. Yeah, Those that's a big deal. Out. That's a big deal. It really hit me the other day when I went to my favorite Mexican restaurant down here. And I'm used to walking in there at 11.30 and it being almost packed. There was not a single soul in that place. And kind of got me. Yeah. yeah, that's when I kind of went, wow, this, this, this is, is the real hurting deal. people. It's hurting people bad right it now. It is, it is. So everyone that's suffering right now that's in industries where you've lost <laughs> your job or you've been furloughed or you've been laid off, we feel for you. We love you. Yeah. We're going to do our best, uh, especially in the Mobile and Baldwin County community. Uh, we'll do our best to uh, help out and buy uh, takeout. I mean, that's the... That's really the best thing that yeah. you can do right yeah. now to help out these restaurants tip for like sure. crazy when you do that. Yeah, and do tip. I, mean, this is I was the only one there, and there was one server who was bringing the takeout, and there was one cook back there, and yeah. there was nobody there. I mean, I was the only one that had takeout at that point. And well, I tipped her fifty percent. I probably should have done a hundred. I almost feel bad that I didn't double up on that. So, and you know, also want to say that uh, I mean, we've got. <clears throat> some decent leaders that's leading this if you look at uh, everyone that's on the council that's uh, pushing this through um, it doesn't care I don't care what your politics are we all need to get through this and we all need to if we can support um, our leadership in trying to get through this and each other yeah exactly and each other. I mean, that's a big deal. So, <clears throat> anyways, y'all stay strong. We love you, Jason and I. Um, two middle aged ex gens. Uh, we'll do our best to uh, put some videos out when we can. But we wanted to come out tonight just to say, stay strong. Yeah. And, um, you know, go out and, you know, buy, take out, and help these <clears throat> uh, small businesses. Do anything you can to help small business in Mobile because they need you right now. Yeah. Okay? All right. So, hey, look, y'all be good. Uh, we love you. Thumbs up. Y'all stay healthy. Y'all stay safe. And we shall uh, see you soon. Okay? See you soon. All right. See you later, guys. <laughs>